so hey everyone welcome back to the channel in this video we will be solving the problem level of nodes so let's read the problem statement out so we are given an integer x and an undirected acyclic graph with v nodes labeled from 0 to v minus 1 and e edges find the level of node labeled as x level is the minimum number of edges you must travel from the node 0 to some target if there doesn't exist a such a node that is labeled as x we need to return minus 1 so what the problem is saying is that you will be given a node and you will be having nodes numbered from 0 to v minus 1 now you need to find the minimum distance by which you can reach that node from the source node for example in this case let's say if our x is going to be 4 you can reach from 0 to 1 then right so this will be taking a two step similarly for this if x is equal to 1 our output is going to be 1 because it takes only one step in order to reach from 0 to 1 so i hope you have understood the problem the expected time complexity for this is going to be order of b and the expected space complexity is also going to be order of b so let's understand this problem in more detail so let's say my graph is like this and we are having the starting vertex as 0 okay it will be zero for all the graphs in this problem what you can do in order to reach the target let's say our target is x is equal to 3 so in order to reach the target in minimum steps we need to follow bfs approach because in bfs what happens you traverse the first node then you traverse all these nodes and then you traverse all these nodes right so bfs is something which will give you the minimum time in order to reach a node okay always remember in graph problems where it is written that you need to find the minimum steps and it's a graph where we are not having any edge weight we will be using a bfs approach okay otherwise if let's say in this graph there would have been a edge let's say four or three for any edge so we will be using dijkstra's algorithm in that so let's do a bfs now in order for this bfs what we need we need the node as well as the distance of the node okay why distance you will know in some time so let's say we make a queue of type pair of intent okay and this pair will be storing first the node and the distance so let's name it as queue now what will be your first step you will be pushing this into the queue okay so zero will be pushed with a distance zero now the next time you iterate you will be taking this out of the queue so my node is going to be zero and distance is going to be zero now you will visit all the neighbors of zero right and it's been given that you have been given the adjacency list so zeros adjacent will be 1 comma 4 similarly one's adjacent will be 2 3 and 0 as well because it's an undirected graph for 2 there are only one neighbor which is one for three there is only one neighbor which is again one right similarly for four the neighbor is going to be five and zero so four neighbor is zero and five and five neighbor is four only okay now since your node is going to be zero you will be visiting all the nodes of zero okay so the first step is going to be push the element into the queue and mark it as visited so visited size will be nothing but number of vertices okay and initially all the vertices will be unvisited so you will check whether one is visited or not no it is not visited so push it into the queue and now in order to reach one you have taken one step right so push this with a distance one now how you will find this distance this will be nothing but this distance plus one okay now similarly 4 is the neighbor of 0 so push 4 with a distance 1 now the next time you will be popping out this and you will be pushing all the neighbors of this into the queue so 2 and with a distance 2 and 3 with a distance 2 right and similarly you will be taking this out and you will be pushing 5 with a distance 2 now next time you will be taking out 2 comma 2 from the queue and the neighbors of 2 is going to be 1 but 1 is already visited so whenever you push any element into the queue you mark it as visited 
so since one is already visited we don't need to do anything for one and our work for two is over next time you take out three comma two and you check like three is the node which is our target node right so this was our target node so in this case our distance is going to be two and you will return this two right so in this way whenever you are iterating on the queue you get this distance you return it otherwise what happens if you are at the end of the queue if you doesn't find this node you will simply return minus one in your answer okay now what will be the time complexity for this the time complexity of simple bfs using adjacency list is going to be order of v plus e and the space complexity is also going to be order of v plus e because you are iterating on the graph right so you will be iterating on each of its vertices as well as edges so it is going to be order of v plus e and the space complexity since you are having all the nodes into the graph so the space complexity is going to be order of v plus e right so i hope you have understood the problem let's discuss the implementation so first of all we will be taking a queue which will be of type pair of int comma int and a vector visited of size v because v is going to be our number of vertices and initially all will be unvisited now we will be pushing out the elements into the queue one by one so zero is going to be my source node so just put zero into the queue with a distance zero and mark it as visited now while my queue is not empty we will be iterating on the queue take out the front of the queue which is going to be pair of intent p now my node is going to be nothing but p dot first and our distance is going to be p dot second now this is a check if our node is going to be equal to our target node we will simply return distance and otherwise we can iterate on the adjacent nodes of the given node right so for auto it in adjacency of node if that is not visited push it into the queue with a distance plus one and mark it as visited and in the end if you are not able to find this target node inside this queue just return minus one so i hope you have understood the problem if you have any doubts write it down in the comments like this video if you have understood share among your friends and don't forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching guys